Good morning, Purple Family. Let's get ready to sing our song. A one and a two and a three. We've been waiting for you to come to this place. Waiting for you to come to this place. Wherever you're from, we're glad that you've come. We've been waiting for you to come to this place. Right, Purple Family, let's come on over and take a look at the calendar. Today is May, last time we were Monday, now we're back on Wednesday, May 13th. That is today, and today is my daughter's birthday. She's gonna be 18 today. But it's someone else's summer birthday. Today is Weston's summer birthday. So we are going to do happy birthday for Weston, and Weston is gonna be five also. And we will put his candles in. Oh, that one's a good one, though. Okay, one more. He will light them. All right, count at home. Make sure we have the right number. One, two, three, four. Sing it home to Weston, you ready? One, and a two, and a three. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Weston. Happy birthday to you. Yay! Happy birthday, Happy Weston! Birthday. All right, so. We are going to do a couple things. Last time we were together, we did, uh, you did your name out of things that you found outside. Today we're gonna do something else. So our prayer today is thank you for things that we find outside in nature, for plants, and maybe you found some sticks, I don't know. So five fingers here, five, five fingers, fingers there. there. Put them together and say a quiet prayer. Dear Lord, thank you for plants that grow and things that are found in nature. Amen. So we are going to do the what's inside bag. I've got the clues. And I'll hand it to Miss Susie. It feels round and a little not too tall. Hmm, not too, not too tall, tall and round. round. All right, so your first clue is, oh, that's a good one. I think I'll give the first clue last. That's third clue, we'll go backwards, is it's plastic. The second clue is it's clear. That means you can kind of see through it. And the first clue is you drink from it. I probably could have said you use it at snack time. Yeah. Miss Susie. <laughs> right. Whoa. It's a cup. A cup from our <laughs> snack time. Oh, and we're going to have, Miss Susie's going to, next video, Miss Susie's going to make you some good stuff for, for snack. So we are going to sing our songs. We're going to go outside and do a little art project and check on our seeds and all types of stuff. So let's start with our songs and then meet me at the science table. Hi, Purple Family. Let's start with our new songs, Make New Friends. You ready? Make new friends. But keep the old one is silver and the other gold. A circle is round, it has no end. That's how long I'm gonna be your friend. All right, and the next one is the boat song. So get out your boats. It goes like this one and a two and a three. When I set sail again, here's what I know. God will be with me wherever I go. When I set sail again, here's what I know. God will be with me wherever I go. Yes, God will be with me wherever I go. All right, Purple Family, we are going to look at our seeds again. And I have to tell you, 
Not much has changed. This is our zucchini plant and it is not sprouting our zucchini seed. And this one is our watermelon seed and it's not doing anything either. So I think we're just gonna leave them. We'll give them another week or two and see what happens. And uh, just sometimes that happens, seeds don't grow. But we're gonna go check out our pea plant outside. So meet me in the garden. All right, Purple family, we're gonna go into the garden and see how our vegetables are growing. our celery. No, it doesn't look like it's moving much. And these are our um, garlic. Our garlic's getting tall and our, um, our romaine. And look at, this is our garlic. It's going to have a flower. And then our little tiny pea plant is not growing very fast. Maybe <laughs> if we give it some water. Oh, you know what we need to check out too? You know what, Miss Susie, you want to check out the, um, if the pumpkins are growing? Sure. And I'll water this? Sure. Oh, it's already open. Check out the compost. Wow. Looks um, like it needs water. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Needs some water too. I'll have to water that. Here we go. Alright. It does need some water. It's pretty dry. Right, purple family we are outside and we're going to do another art project with some things that you find outside maybe around your home or on a walk so you'll need a piece of paper and then I have some different squirt bottles yours at home may look a little different than these and I put some water in them and we have we use our um, our watercolors but if you have food coloring or something like that you can put in there to color it and then I went in the front of our school and I found a leaf another a green leaf and these are really pretty red leaf and this is a um a piece of lavender from the front yard so you put them any way you want maybe you want to make a design no then you're going to take your squirt bottle and squirt as much or as little as you want this one is purple so i was going to add a little purple to that and when you're all done you peel up Oh, that one's kind of hard to see. Can you see that? And peel this one off. Oh, that one's a little better. And it makes, it leaves, so I think maybe you need bigger leaves, but you can still see my little leaves and you let it dry and you'll have a little print of your, your flowers and your leaves that you found. So that is our art project for today. Hi, Purple family, we are gonna read a story and then say goodbye. So this is called The Little Red Fort. And sometimes in a story, the words tell the story, but also the picture. So this is a little girl, and she's drawing a picture of what she wants to make. Ruby's mind was always full of ideas. One day, she found some old boards. Who wants to help me build something? She asked her brothers. Oscar Lee pretended not to hear her. Rodrigo gave her a look that could melt popsicles. Jose almost fell off the fence. You don't know how to build anything, they said. Ruby shrugged. Then I'll learn. Got the tape measure out there measuring. And she did. Who wants to help me draw the plans? Ruby asked. The boys clutched their sides and howled with laughter. Not me, said Oscar Lee. I don't think so, said Rodrigo. No way, said Jose. I'm too busy. Fine, said Ruby. I'll draw them myself. And she did. So there she is. A plan is what you're going to make. You draw a picture of what you're going to make. Satisfied with her plans, Ruby asked, who wants to help me gather the supplies? Not me, said Oscar Lee. I don't think so, said Rodrigo. 
No way, said Jose. I'm too busy. Fine, said Ruby. I'll gather them myself. And she did. Got a big box of material. When all the supplies were gathered, Ruby asked, who wants to help me cut the boards? Not me, said Oscar Lee. I don't think so, said Rodrigo. No way, said Jose. I'm too busy. Fine, said Ruby. I'll cut them myself. And she did. Looks like her mom was helping her. When all the boards were neatly cut, Ruby sang, who wants to help me hammer in the nails? Not me, said Oscar Lee. I don't think so, said Rodrigo. No way, said Jose. I'm too busy. Fine, said Ruby. I'll hammer them myself. And she did. Maybe Grandma's helping out too a little bit. Soon Ruby's creation was complete. Who wants to play in my fort? She called. Me, me, said Oscar Lee. Let's go, said Rodrigo. I'll play, said Jose. I'm not busy anymore. I'm just going to let them in. Not so fast, Ruby said. You didn't help me draw the plans or gather the supplies, or cut the boards, or hammer the nails. You said I didn't know how to build, but you laughed at me. I'm going to play in the fort by myself. And she did. Even had the little sign that says Ruby's Fort. We didn't want to play anyway, said the boys, but they did. So they huddled, whispered, and got straight to work. Oscar Lee made a mailbox. Rodrigo planted flowers. Jose painted a, the fort fire engine red. Ruby was delighted. That evening, the boys followed a delicious aroma to a fort warming party. Who wants to help me clean this plate, Ruby asked. We do, said the boys. And they did. So that is Ruby's fort. Oh, these are some other good ideas on how to build a fort. You can build a fort out of sofa cushions or kitchen chairs with um, blankets. Oh, and if we lived in the snow, you can build one out of the snow, or if you have a bunk bed, hang some blankets over that so you guys can build a fort at home. All right, that is it. We're gonna sing the goodbye song, and we will see you Friday on our next video. One, and two, and three. May the circle be unbroken. By and by, Lord, by and by, we will see you all someday. But for now, we say goodbye. Goodbye, Joshua. Goodbye, Dominic. Goodbye, Parker S. and Zach, too. Goodbye, Sloan. Goodbye, Blaine. Goodbye, Parker J. and Marcio, too. Goodbye, Elodie. <laughs> Goodbye, Caden. Goodbye, Trevor and Ellen, too. Goodbye, Weston. Goodbye, Miss Susie. Miss Nikki and Miss Alexa, too. May the circle be unbroken. By and by, Lord, by and by, we will see you.